What's up guys, TJ back with Catholic Outdoors and we're out here again. The queen baby. The freaking queen. We're out here for another lake trout day. Getting our stuff set up. We got three and a half inches. It's been so warm out. We've had 45 degree days and we are on clear black ice baby. People are saying Lake George is wide open. It ain't wide open. It ain't wide open. Feels amazing to be back out here. We're here with Burke and Bennett. So hopefully we can put on a show today and uh, absolutely slay some lake trout. All right, guys, I'm gonna get some jaw jackers set up and uh, let's get right into it. Look at this beautiful sunrise, guys. We got a little mix of everything, purple, pink, blue what a beautiful morning on lake george i'm setting out my bait lines right now for my draw jackers and tip ups i have three draw jackers two tip ups um, i'm using uh, baby suckers and icicles for my draw jackers and tip ups also i have started to switch my draw jacker rods over to the draw jacker rod for the draw jacker the 36 inch lake trout to be exact and uh, that seems to be working pretty well so far. The action on them and the, the, the hook set on them tends to be uh, right on the money. So, uh, yeah. Here's Anthony Bedden and Burt Collins putting out their setups. They pretty much use the same type of rig I'm using. They only use jaw jackers. They have about six jaw jackers a piece. And uh, they're using the same type of bait, um, baby suckers, icicles, and then they also had some smelt that they jigged up earlier on for bait as well. And that tends to be candy for the lake trout. You put that down, boy, man, they're right after that. Alrighty, guys, let's get this whole drill for tip -up. Don't mind my voice, I have a, a cold right now, so it could be a little, uh, you know, a little messed up. Start investing in uh, more more jaw jackers. I hate tip ups. Jaw jackers, amazing. These things suck. All right, all my uh, tip ups and jaw jackers down. I got three jaw jackers out, two tip ups. That's five bait lines, and then I'll have be jigging with my black rain. So yeah. Um, just got to, the boys are finishing up their setups and uh, that's about it. So let's get out there and uh, get to jigging. I'm jigging in 52 feet of water. Just using a small paddle tail. Swim bait. Beautiful out here. Doesn't seem to be no current today. Here I see Anthony starting to head over to his flag, and that's my signal to start heading over with the film gear. Anthony's got a flag. Boy, look at this guy run. No ice spikes, black, clear ice, and he is running like you Asian bolt across that ice, man. This guy is an absolute beast, and that's why all the frickin' chicks love him. Run, Forrest, run! <laughs> It's a chrome. Feels it. 
Special bait on. Don't feel like a laker. Yeah. Uh, no, icicle. Give them huge fuckers. A laker? Yep. yep. Nice one. Those icicles are huge. Nice one. Very nice. I don't know how to come in here shallow. I didn't mark those. Oh, I didn't even check on one of those. You're 10 feet down, yeah. I'll take those all day. Yeah, still bigger than the small, biggest one we got off screwing. I know. I, like to see, I already missed one. Sweet. Nice. Beautiful. I just got lines in the water. Nice job. Nice. Alrighty, just got back. Anthony caught a nice laker. Let's get back down jigging again. Setting up a time lapse and a freaking just came right off the bottom. Right off the bottom. Totally engulfed it. Do it. Awesome. Nice one, guys. Sweet. Sweet. Fatty. Yeah. Got some meat the on him. Nice. Almost 25 and a half. Sweet. Let's get you back, buddy. Sweet, let's go. Beautiful 25 inch fatty on the tungsten. Boy came right off the bottom. Totally engulfed it, no chase, nothing. Well, let's get back down there. Put a new swim bait on and uh, yeah. Well guys, didn't get it on recording, but had one fly right off the bottom and break me off. Uh, yeah, not good, but we are back and tied back up and uh, ready to go again. No chase, nothing, just fly right off the bottom and golf it. And that's probably like five minutes after that last one. See you guys. Pretty uh, successful morning so far. Two fish landed. I broke off on one. One jaw jacker for Anthony. One jigging for me. So yeah. Just wait on uh, old Bert to get one and then we'll all uh, be hooked up. Beautiful out here, sun coming out. Uh, Hopefully, get a nice full day out on here. So, yeah, I hope some of these jawjackers start popping.
this place is tend to have a very good uh, afternoon jaw jacker bite, so non-stop action. So let's hope that happens. Here's some beautiful drone footage of Lake George, aka the Queen. Being out on the Queen is just absolutely serene. It is amazing to be out here. If you haven't been out there, you have to try it. Just being over that crazy deep water is just a great feeling. As soon as that sun came out, the bite turned on. We had a great afternoon bite. As soon as that sun started to come up, the ice was deteriorating under our feet. I also want to speak about the ice being very thin. Just because we're out here doesn't mean it's safe for everyone else or you feel comfortable with coming out on that type of ice. We have striker ice suits, safety spikes around our neck, and a throw bag with rope on it just in case if one of us goes through. And we are also very experienced and we've been out on this ice before and such thin ice. And the afternoon bite is about to explode. See what he's got. Nice. Green as snow. Beautiful. Nice. Fatty. Uh, eating good. Yeah. He come up to the chaser and then he came back down and then he. Sweet. Nice. Beautiful. Then he uh, started playing around with the tube in the bottom, so I let him take that. Nice. Buddy gave me some of that hair kick that was trying. Oh, that was cool. That was a good one. That was a good one. Just, just got done with Anthony. Zach's got one up now. You hear that ice cracking behind me? And it's cracking under my feet as well. Those big noises you guys just heard split open the ice. Another big split noise. Jesus Christ. Got another. Another one right there. Big cracks. Oh, I have another jacket. Yeah, we walked it over. Get him, Burke. Oh, nice one, Burke. Nice one. Nice, nice. Fatty. All big fatties today. It's like a little mini shark down there. Look at that. Look at that. Right. He's, look at this. I'm sitting on him. <laughs> I love that black ice. Yes, sir. Black rain, black, black ice. Rain, black ice. <laughs> Circling around. Sweet guys. <laughs> oh, I thought you land away. There we go. <laughs> right there. Nice That's shot, Burke. Thank you very much. 
Boom. Jacker hooks up. That is a beautiful lake trout. To the depths. Sit here all day now. Just gotta keep an eye on it. Anthony's hooked up. As soon as Burke's done, Anthony's hooked up. I just put bait back on it. There wasn't any bait on it. <laughs> Sam? Lake. Yeah. I took that one out because the water is starting to creep up. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Beautiful colors. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the best part with the clear ice is watching them go. Oh, oh you family friendly channel, Tyler. Right I was trying hole. to play him long enough for you to get there. That was a good 30 incher. Oh my god. That had to be at least a 30, dude. <laughs> I was playing him, trying to wait for him to get over here. He was he hit me twice. Oh! He just broke mine off too. He broke Burke's off too. Broke you off? He broke Burke and me. Two jigs in his mouth. <laughs> That fish hit three times. Hit me once, then I got him, and then That's hooks crazy. it. He wasn't alone either. No. Yeah, yeah there we go. Sweet. Yo, gulpers. Yes, sir. Look at that cool nose he I could see him down there. He was only freaking 15 feet down when he hit. Try to go that way. Get that. 30 incher, 30 incher, uh -huh. maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, maybe. Be the dirty. Here's some amazing drone footage from the Queen, aka Lake George. As you guys can tell, it was just a wonderful day out on the ice. Beautiful ice, beautiful sun, and some great friends to fish with.
I had so many clips from today's video, but I could not just put them all in because it would be a very, very long video. Uh, we caught a lot of fish this day. As soon as that sun started to get a little higher in the sky, it started to open up some of those pressure cracks that already formed. And the ice was definitely getting worse and worse by the hour. The ice that we were on today was very, very sketchy. As you could see, Timmy, aka TJ, made some guest appearances. And as you could see by his face, it looked like he was scared shitless and he wasn't even out there for the day. This was our second day of getting on Lake George of three days that we fished. We have our third day coming up. That video will come out next week. And boy, we caught some really, really big lake trout that day. I would also like to say, I love running around filming my team members of Casco Outdoors. There's some times where I don't even want to take out my ice fishing gear and I just want to record my team members. I love doing it and I love seeing the smiles on their face and it's just a great feeling. Not only is Anthony Bennett and Bert Collins team members of Catskill Outdoors, they are family to me. They are a part of the Catskill Outdoors Nation, Catskill Outdoors team, and I love having them around. And I have learned so much from them. If you guys enjoyed the video, please subscribe, like, comment, turn on post notifications. You know the deal already. And this is TJ signing out. Peace out, Catskill Outdoors Nation. And little Timmy too.